I'll give you ten bucks if you do. <laughs> ten dollars. What do you mean? So you want me to record a video of this game? You want me to try hard this game? Oh dear God. Here we go. I'm oh, free. Wait, you do? Yeah. Yeah. So what? Like that means like, if, if I sponsor you, I give you like the money to create better videos. Yeah. If you sponsor me on YouTube, yeah. it does help out. Yeah. So. If you put, if you if you make this a video, bro, you you know what's coming your way. <laughs> you don't have to, man. All right, I'm gonna try hard this game. Sorg's out. Let's get it. Oh, are you gonna go sweaty? Sweaty. It's been so long since I've actually tried hard. I've done so much sniping and ninja defusing. All right, I'm rushing mid. I got a sorg, and we get a rock and roll. Yeah, bro, I got you. Stun out. I got two stun here. Easy. Alright, let's just shred these guys. I'm gonna literally try to run straight through them. This one here. Yes. Bro. Alright, one left. Calm down. <laughs> okay, I'll oh, he's running around. Oh no, he's got the flashlight. He's got the... Get out of there, man. Oh my god. Be careful. I missed. Oh no. I just oh, my wow. shots. <laughs> that thing's so scrubby. Oh my. It's okay. I literally hate that shotgun. Yeah. With a passion. Just... Triumph literally. I'll you to go off, bro. <laughs> yeah. Treyarch literally added a flashlight to the brekkie. What do you mean? Have you got, um, what's it called? Uh, dark matter? Do you have dark matter? Yeah. I got that oh, pretty quickly. you are sweetie. Bro, like, how quick? How quick? A uh, couple of weeks, I think? I literally just went for headshots, though. Like, I was grinding headshots. Even if it meant I died, I was just going for the head. Alright, last guy's with me. He's got the flashlight! Get off me, boy! What are you doing with oh, that thing? Oh, you still got that. Why are you guys in that chopper, dude? Bro, I'm rocking the shotgun with the with the dragon oh, breath. Oh, so good. <laughs> I'm gonna rock a strobe light shotgun just to counter your shit. No, I don't do it. Strobe light is bad, okay? Bro, he dies. Yo, set up. Your class set up. My class set up. It's just a sword. Alright. I'm Ooh. countering them by rocking dual swords. They're gonna use shotguns, I'm gonna use dual wheels. Let's rush mid. Okay. Oh, bro. bro I screwed everyone's up Everyone's pushing mid. They're all on head glitches. I can't really, like, just run in there with these things. Oh. Screw it. Let's go! All together, help me! He's on top of it. Yes. Good work. All right, the rest are around blue. They're oh, in yeah. our spawn. They're behind us. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I seen one. Other side, other side, other side. Yeah, 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 yeah. right here. Oh my god, flashlight so shotgun, get out of here! Alright, two people left. Get him! Oh, oh, oh dude, our oh, squad is so is turned up right that? now. I feel bad for the other Come team. Come on, man. <laughs> Turn down to like... Dude, it's 4v5 as well, and we're just shredding. What do you mean? This ain't even fair. Oh, what is this guy? But that's disgusting, bro. <laughs> LMG, shotguns, so many newbie classes. That's I'm gonna use your gun. Aiden, uh... Right. The August. Yeah. Oh my god. Ronnie. I'm probably gonna get my head taken off here. This is cocky. I got one. Uh, right. Oh, my man. Mid, 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 oh, yeah, they're in blue. I'm trying to find the ground. I got one. There's two people left. Oh. Right here. Let's go. Oh, yeah, yeah. Dude. Well, that wasn't nice. What do you mean? That was that easy. That was quick as. I, sorry to the other team for tryharding. Yeah, bro, I had to. You. The YouTube. Oh, I got bribed. Uh, I got blackmailed. Uh, um, you know, you know what's coming your way, bro. <laughs> you don't have to, man. You don't have to. You, Let's go. you deserve it, you know. Oh, appreciate that, dude. What are we gonna title the video? I got bribed to make a video. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're like 15 year old kid. Um. <laughs> I got no, blackmailed. Bro. <laughs> Fifteen-year-old kid needs me to make a video. Gone wrong. Potato aim, I got you. You asked me to carry you. I got you this game. Just don't live up to your name. If you got potato aim, we're probably gonna lose this. Oh my god. They're in middle. Gotta be careful. One down bottom here. Oh no, we're so screwed. No, shot in the back. You hate to see it. Cup of coffee. Okay, the prestige master gave me the pee. I think it's time to get the sword out. I can't go try hard and not have oh, a good game. Oh, and so, do I see a flashlight shotgun on the other team? Dude, you hate to see that one as well. I swear every lobby has a guy, a complete noob running around with this. But yeah, this guy right here is a prestige master. He's actually a ridiculously good player. He's a beast. We're going to have to sweat extra hard. 
My teammate wanted me to carry him. So I'm gonna have to do my best. All right, let's get this. Sword time, baby. Your inferior needs to carry us. <laughs> Your inferior needs to carry. I'm trying, man. I got the sword. I got you. Okay, two can cast. That's perfect. Cup of coffee. Prestige master down. One out the back here. Oh my. Good work, teammate. Yeah, so like I was saying is, my um class is double stock and grip. That, I think that's the most powerful... Dear God. There's one more here. Yeah, but I think it's the most powerful on the sword, right? Like, double stock having the movement. The enemies just sometimes struggle to hit their shots. And the sword's a super fast killing gun. Low-ish recoil. So you can literally shred with it. But yeah. I also run double concussions, which is super good for rushing and like slowing down the enemies in certain spots. The reason I run two of them is because if you run two, you get one at the start of every S&D round. Which I sort of don't want to tell you guys that because if you guys start using double concussions, then yeah, it's it's a rip in the chat for me. Tagmas does count a double concussion, so. Alright. Cuss in. Okay, I screwed that concussion up. There's one here. Oh, I'm a dip. Screw that. There's too many there. Alright, teammates climbed up top here. Brilliant. We got some map control. you yeah, love to see it. We gotta go hard though. We can't have like a try hard game. My teammate asked me to carry him and not do well. Good work, man. Right. Where are these kills? I literally can't find these guys this round. Doesn't look like the camping spawn. Two people left. Teammates going ham. Turning up. you love to see that one. Right. Where are these last two guys? Okay, one's up top there. Oh my... See you later, alligator. All right, one dude left. Where is this guy? Oh no, it's the flashlight shotgun guy. And teammate gets him. Let's go, man. Like I was saying before, there is always a guy with a freaking flashlight shotgun. It is, they just need to delete it from the game. It is like one of the most skillless things in Call of Duty history, right? It's like the Brecky with a flashlight, you know? Nobody liked the Brecky shotgun and they decided to put a freaking flashlight on it. Also, another thing that I don't agree with as well, and that's acoustic sensor. Now, you might see me running it on some classes. I'm running Stim on this class, but acoustic sensor takes away from the skill of the game somewhat. You know, it slows down the pace of the game. In Respawn, it's not so bad, but in s &D where everything's so quiet, you can hear the enemies from a mile away, and it turns bad players into good players because they can just camp and know exactly where you are, like an orbital VSAT at all times. You know, you can have dead silence on, and they can just hear you, and they'll camp back and just sound horse and depend on the sound of footsteps. It's like literally the most annoying thing, and all my teammates are dying, and they plant the frigging bomb. You hate to see it. 1v5. Are you kidding me? Okay. We've got the Master Prestige. Try hard. Let's go. Oh my, that was close. It's gonna be like impossible. we got 14 seconds. Ah! Oh my god. That was sort of messy. I'm... Get off me! I, I thought I was gonna die. The other guy's shooting at me. Get off me, boy! But like I was saying... Acoustic sensor, I would not have been able to get that clutch with, you know? Because I gotta heal quickly. Stim's pretty powerful as well, but acoustic sensor, I feel like in s &D, it sort of ruins it, and I feel like it needs a nerf, you know? It's got six cents, which nobody really liked in Black Ops 3 and thought it was cheap, and awareness, paired together, more powerful than ever, you know? You can hear enemies with dead silence so loudly in this game that, like, camping and sound whoring's a really good strategy for bad players in s &D, you know? I don't camp but I feel like I need to run acoustic sensor sometimes for the simple reason, why should I give the campers the advantage, right? The only way to counter acoustic sensor isn't by dead silence, because it doesn't technically counter it, because they can still hear you, is by running it yourself, so you can hear them. But then again, if they're not moving, you can't hear them anyway, so like, you know? But acoustic sensor is like the only way to counter acoustic sensor, which is crazy. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comments. Maybe you guys don't play as much, or like come across the same people I do, but I run into so many people to just run that perk and there's one guy left i think he's up top there somewhere oh wait wait my drone squad literally just hit marking him the heck is this guy but yeah i run into it all the time people camping with it so i've grown to hate the perk and i just know how little skill it takes okay he was up top there this is a prestige master oh my just so weak i think this prestige master is running acoustic sensor but he hasn't really been camping so like i haven't got a problem with it Okay. It's all on you. This guy's being tricked. What are you? He's pre firing. What are you pre firing? I'm even here, bro. <laughs> what do you mean? But yeah. So, my problem with the acoustic sensor is that it just takes away from the skill of the game. 
Let me know what you guys think, though. Some of you guys probably don't run into it as much. Like, if you play Respawn and not as much S&D, or you're not playing as many S&D tryhards, you wouldn't run into it as much. But it's, like, one of the most frustrating things, right? Because it gives bad players a mega advantage. Good players as well will give an advantage. You know, an unfair advantage. Like, basically an orbital VSAT if you got your headset cranked up all the way. You can tell exactly where they are. Alright, we got the Mantis. We actually go in this game. I like it. We started off sort of slow. But now we're turning up, and we got one Kakas. Copper! I got the Prestige Master. I think I stunned him one of the first rounds. I'm surprised he still went up there, or didn't use Tack Mask. Okay. We got a Tack Deploy right there. I'm not going to destroy it, because I sort of want an extra kill. I'm not going to lie. I've seen somebody run up there. Mantis gets a kill. Perfect. Right. I could use my shield, but it's just going to slow me down. Alright, one guy left. Should I call my UAV in? Yeah. I'm hoping my teammates don't steal this kill, though. Wait, where is he? Oh, this is a attack deploy guy, wasn't he? He'll be out of... Wait, what the... Oh, my God. Teammate actually saved my life there. He's freaking behind me. 15 and 1, though. What a solid game. Yo, potato aim. Yo, I gotta put my mic in. Yo, potato aim. You asked me to carry you. I got you, man. Oh, yes. You flip and carry. <laughs> I got you, man. Anyway, if you guys did enjoy, don't forget to smack that like button. And if you're not subscribed, hit that one too. Peace out, bros.